Hi Capricorn, it's Elle here to do your weekly reading. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It means a lot. Please continue to do so. All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. Let's go ahead and get into it, Capricorn. Thank you, God, for blessing Capricorn with a clear, concise message from you. All right, so Capricorn, we have the Queen of Pentacles. We have the Sun card. We have the Seven of Cups. And then we have the Knight of Pentacles. Okay. Um, so it looks like uh, somebody's a mom, a new mom. There's a new baby here. Um, somebody has to be responsible now. You know, they have to do the responsible thing. Something about mundane, boring. I don't know. Um, but reliable, devoted, loyal. Okay. It looks like somebody is out for themselves. They're doing their own thing. Could be working on their body, working on how they look, their home. They're focused on themselves. Uh, it's easier to do that. It's easier. It's easier to maintain and to manage. Um, somebody is just not focused on uh, anything outside of them, outside of um, manifesting what it is they want for themselves. With the Queen of Pentacles, this could be you, Capricorn. It could be someone else. There's new life here. There's new, new life, new abundance. A new person, maybe even coming into your life, bringing you a lot of abundance. Okay. Um, there could be a proposal or somebody is already uh, engaged here. Now it's a lot of wishful thinking, a lot of promises being made. And now we have to see if it's actually going to come into fruition. Um, maybe even some procrastination. Um, maybe even even overindulging um, with the seven of cups here. Wanting something but not going after it wanting a better relationship but not actually doing the work for it saying things that you really don't mean you have no intention of fulfilling any of the promises there could have been a cheating spouse here and a new child was a baby is the product of that cheating spouse okay therefore the the um wife is concerned about herself her life, her business, her job, and not concerned with um, the fact that somebody else has an outside responsibility. It could be the end of this relationship or the end of how the relationship looks. You know, like this could be the beginning of the end for someone. Yeah. Somebody had a lot of options. They explored one and then it turned into something that they can't get rid of, which is a child. And then it made the relationship kind of go to a place of, um, now it's different. The dynamic of the relationship is different. It has transformed or uh, transitioned into a blended family. Somebody's definitely focused on themselves, not even looking at this person anymore because of this new, this new baby, this new thing. It's heartbreaking. And it really broke up maybe like a 10 of pentacles type of relationship where, where somebody felt like they had everything, but this new person, new child, new something it came in and threw a monkey wrench, maybe broke down the relationship that it seemed so solid. It seemed so lasting. Somebody isn't happy with the, the, the uh, marriage, but they're, I don't know if they're going to stay together. Somebody's not happy with the marriage. They might stay together just because of what they built. And some of you might divorce. Yeah, excuse me. Some of you might divorce because um, it's too much to bear. It's like the evidence of the cheating, you know, which is this new child or, or this woman who's pregnant or this woman who says she's pregnant or something about that. that that's interesting. But something that has broken up the connection, broken down the connection. 
it's a third party really stirring trouble up here you could get over it you could not it is up to you this is what i have for you capricorn if it resonates let me know how it resonates for you down in the comment section also you can go over to the website and book your own reading there uh, catch me live every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday night, 9.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. You can ask questions. You can tune in for the collective reading. Thank you, guys. Many blessings to you. Take care.